underlying themes of this conference is the use of technology, and that is where the growth is coming from, technology to change lives for the better. Joining me this morning is the Chief Investment Officer for KeyWise Capital Management, Fang Zhang. And Fang, it's good to have you on the program because you've been really a, a great investor out there. You invested early on in Alibaba. You invested in Tencent um, and, and Zogan uh, Online Insurance in China. Some of the, the areas where the Chinese huge population are going to be uh, benefiting, and, and also obviously those companies will benefit from the from the huge population. Do you still own Alibaba? Yes, I still own Alibaba. Yeah. yeah. Actually, we're increasing the position in the company. You're increasing the position. Why? Yes. I think uh, Alibaba used to be viewed as a Chinese company. Right now, it become a global company. I think I just read the news. Alibaba chairman. Jack Ma just met with the president of the Philippines, tried to bring the e-payments to 7,000 islands in the Philippines, yeah. which will enable the country to have the technology, you know, which used, cannot be available for them in the past. You know, it's incredible because yesterday on the panel, I spoke with um, the head of SoftBank, obviously, Masayoshi-san, and he said that the Alibaba investment was his single biggest, best investment he put $20 million into the company, which is now valued at $150 billion. How's that for a return? Wow, that is amazing. <laughs> I know. You know, I think uh, this, I think the compounded returns of 47% for 18 years. Incredible. I want to talk about some of the other investments that you have. You recently invested in a company that teamed up with Adidas for the first consumer-ready 3D printed sports shoe. Yes. This is incredible. Will you show the sneakers? These were made by sure. a 3D machine, 3D printing. This is a 3D printing shoes. I'll take one. Yeah. How is this done? How the heck is it? Well, this is the uh, technology which has uh, revolutionized a traditional 3D printing technology. As you know, the traditional 3D printing is layer by layer. And uh, what happened is uh, layer by layer means that uh, it is a very slow and also fragile because every single printing point become a joint. Right. So it cannot be, can only watch, but it cannot be used. But the company which I invested called Carbon 3D, they using very different technology. So the technology, instead of printing, they pull the shape out of a liquor right. using new technology which has uh, speed up the process and uh, also make uh, the, this uh, uh, shape much more stronger. So is the bottom also 3D printing? The, the bottom, the most important is the bottom. The bottom, yes. oh, that's most important. Yes. And this is, uh, and also it's, it is, uh, you know, flexible. Yeah. And uh, they can make the stronger. They can also print your bones, wow. your teeth. Fung, how, how expensive is 3D technology versus other technologies? I mean, 3D printing, is that much more expensive because you have layer after layer after layer? That's the traditional one. That's the old 3D printing technology I based see. on layer and layer. But the new one doesn't. The new one doesn't. That's why the new one has the technology which is significantly reducing the cost and also significantly speed up the process. By the way, Adidas is doing really well right now. Yes, uh, correct. And, and, and this is, you, you partnered with Adidas to come, come out with this. This is incredible. Yeah. Fang, thank you. My pleasure. Great to see you. Good to see you. Fang yeah. Sang joining us there.